everyone, Animal Girl here, back with another edition of TV Talk. It's Tuesday, and that means it's Star Wars Day. And this week's episode of Star Wars The Clone Wars was... Dooku Captured. While attempting to capture Count Dooku in an attempt to bring an end to the Clone Wars, Anakin and Obi-Wan manage to lose him when he es escapes in a ship. However, Dooku's ship crash lands on a small planet known as, or a planet known as Florum, where he is encountered by a band of pirates. Hoping to negotiate his way out, he makes an offer to pay them, but of course, the leader of the pirates, one Hondo Anako, has plans of his own for the leader of the Separatist army. Okay, things I liked about this episode. I really liked Florum. It is one of my favorite planets within the Star Wars universe, and one that we don't really see you know, outside of the Clone Wars TV show. I mean, we see a little, we get a little glimpse of it in um, Revenge of the Sith, but that's about it. Uh, we mo It's mostly focused on within the Star Wars, Clone Wars TV show. Um, I don't even think we've actually seen it in Rebels yet. Um, that might change in Season 3. Also, I did like the storyline. I thought the storyline was very easy to follow. Um, so I did like that. I, I love it when, it's, when it's, I really like it when storylines do not get very complicated. So, um, cause I feel if you add too much in, it's really hard to under to really follow what's going on. So I really like that the storyline was very easy to follow. Also, there was a lesson in here at the end. Um, Obi-Wan kind of states, states it at the end. So I did like that. Also, I l really liked Hondo Onako, who is played by Jim Cummings. Um, Hondo is one of my top 20 favorite Star Wars characters. He actually did make the list. Um, make that list. I'm not going to say where he stands on the list. So you're just going to have to check out my top 20 favorite Star Wars characters um, video to find out where he stands. Um, but I just... Um, one of the things I really like about Hondo um, without getting into Rebels or anything is... I love his, A, his design. I mean, his design in Clone Wars is really, really good. I mean, he looks like a space pirate in Clone Wars. I, he, he, like, he looks like a cross between a um, pirate from an old um, Caribbean pirate movie or Caribbean pirate movie and a pirate from a sci-fi movie so it's a nice blend and I really liked that about him uh and you know Wayden's um for those of you who have seen Rebels you know that his look does change in Rebels but not that much so I um but I want to kind of stick with Clone Wars so I really liked his um Clone Wars design in Rebels um another thing I really like about him is that he's very much a gray character um he's not necessarily a bad guy, but he's not necessarily a good guy. I mean, a lot of the times, um, and you'll see in other ep other TV talk episodes for Clone Wars and later Rebels, that he's actually trying to do the right thing. He just, he doesn't really want to take sides, so he's kind of playing both sides um, to um, stay that, to um, kind of not get in trouble with either side. Um, you'll see that per, per Mostly in Rebels, um, but um, not so much here as kind of what happens in this episode between him and Dooku. But other than that, um, that's one of the things I like about him. Okay, things I really didn't like about this episode, there's really just kind of one little thing. It's not a big thing. It's just something I really want to address is that they took the focus off the Jedi and the Republic and also off the war. I just didn't put it in there. Um... A lot of the a lot of the episodes here focus on either the Jedi or the Republic or the Separatist Army or the war. And this one really didn't. It, it was really the primary goal of this episode, I believe, was to introduce Hondo and his crew. 
and um, honestly, and I did not put this in things I liked about this episode, but I'm going to say it right here. I really that I really thought this episode did a very good job of introducing Hondo and his pirates. Um, and this is actually part of a. It's part of a two. Mo it's part of a two. Um, episode arc, so next week will be the second part, well, technically the second part of this episode. Um, I mean, it's not listed as the second, as a two-parter, but I mean, I kind of feel since they, the two episodes kind of tie in together, it's, they kind of go together. Um, so, um, I, so, um, all in all, it's a good episode. Um, not one of my least favorites, but not one of my absolute favorites. Um, I like it because it does introduce one of my... It does introduce some new characters, and it does... Well, character, um, as Hondo's really the only one that's given a name. Um, and it does introduce um, one of my favorite characters, so I did like that about it. So, um, but all in all, like I said, does, um, because it takes focus off of the main theme of the show, which is, um, the Clone Wars and whatnot, it, it's not one of my favorites as well, but, it, you know, it's, it's middle ground, which is pretty good, so. Okay, question of the week is, what do you think of Hondo and his band of pirates? Please leave your answers in the comment section. Also, um, what series would you like me to review for Thursday's TV Talks in about eight weeks, as I will be done with um, Big O by then? Your choices are Avatar The Last Airbender, Knights of the Zodiac, Once Upon a Time, and Bidden. And what series would you like me to review? Oh, you know what? I mixed those up. It's nine weeks for Thursday, eight weeks for Monday. Excuse me. Um... But what series would you like me to review in eight weeks? I'm sorry for the little typo there. That's my fault. Um, for Monday's TV Talks. And your choices are Game of Thrones, Mountain Monsters, Superman the Animated Series, and Fruit Baskets. I will have little like if you want this episode for Thursday or Monday. Um, in the little comment section, all you have to do is like or love for your choice for Thursday, and again, for your choice for Monday, whichever one gets the most votes, I will do. Please note that you have until um, Monday, September 11th, to cast your votes for Monday's episode, and thurs or, yeah, Thursday, September 21st to cast your votes for Thursday's show as Tuesday, September 12th. I'll be announcing the winner for Monday's video and Friday, September 22nd, I'll be announcing the winner for Thursday's video. Um, so please make your voices known. Also note that in the event of a tie or no votes, I have, um, I, I have... I, I'm going to be picking the episode so um, that I'm going to do for both of them. Um, you know, if I don't have, if I have a tie for Thursday, um, and Thursday and a tie in Friday or Monday, excuse me, um, I'll just pick. Or if you know nobody votes, so you know, please vote. I want I want to know what you want me to do, um, wh or what series you would like me to review. So please, please cast your votes. Um, Please leave your comments in the comment section. Um, also, feel free to um, please like and subscribe. That helps me out a lot. Um, also, feel free to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Um, the information will be in the description section, but it's also right here because there has been some confusion. Um, I use a completely diff a different account. I have a Gmail account, which um, YouTube is linked to, um, and I... A Yahoo account, which my Twitter and Instagram are linked to. So my Twitter and Instagram are actually under my Yahoo account. So I have a completely different screen name for those, and it's listed right there. It's Anime Princess One. Um, because there, I'm just letting you guys know that because there has been some confusion, um, as to my Twitter and Instagram account. So they're right there. Um, so just type those in for my Twitter and Instagram accounts if you want to follow me on those. Um, you know, that, that's just to help you guys out. Um, okay, so, 
Related videos are listed right there. And these just these are just like all my Star Wars videos that are not TV talk videos. Um, you'll see or they're not TV so you know feel free to check them out. Um also here are my other TV Talk Star Wars videos. And feel free to check out my other TV Talk videos. You will see there is a new one that has been added, and that is Walker Texas Ranger, which debuted last Wednesday. Um, feel free to also check out my other videos. The categories are listed right there, and then there's also my last unicorn video, which is my five subscriber special. Okay, so thank you so much for watching, and may the force be with you.